Hi, I'm Seb with Berkey Water Filters in the UK. Today I'm going to show you how to assemble the Big Berkey water filter system. So the first thing we do is to install the handle on the lid. Simply take your handle and unscrew the small screw from the base. Push the screw with the small washer fitted through the hole in the middle of your lid. The screw should point from the inside to the outside. Next we screw the knob onto the screw thread. Make sure it's tight but don't over tighten it. The second step is to install the spigots into the lower chamber. This is the spigot. We place the washer so the rounded end faces inwards towards the tank and the flat side against the spigot. Slide the spigot through the tank and place the flat washer onto the stem from the inside of the chamber. And finally, fasten the locker nut onto the thread to hold it securely. It should be tightened by hand, but not over tightened. Our third step is to install the filters inside the upper chamber. Before installing them, be sure that you've primed and cleaned the filters. This will ensure you get the best performance and the maximum lifespan from them. Please see our priming video for details on how to correctly perform this procedure. Here we can see that the big Berkey has four holes. Every Berkey system comes as standard with two filters. So we're going to use two of the holes for the filters and the other two we'll seal with the two provided blocking plugs. First we take the filters, remove the wing nuts and place the large black washer on the stem. Insert the black filter and screw the wing nuts in place tightening by hand. Be careful again not to over tighten the wing nuts as they can break with too much force. We then do the same with the second filter, placing the filters in opposite holes. The filters should not be installed next to each other, not side by side but opposite. Now we can install the blocking plugs and seal the two extra holes. There are two different variations of blocking plugs, black ones and white ones. Unscrew the wing nuts and remove one of the provided washers. Place the plug through the hole, seating the first washer against the base of the chamber. Slide the second washer up on the thread from the outside of the chamber and then refit the wing nut, again carefully tightening by hand. Here we can see that the filters are in place. They're opposite each other and secure. They do move slightly and this is perfectly normal for them. They are fine to lean slightly to the sides. We're now ready to place the upper chamber with the filters installed onto the lower chamber. And finally, place the lid on top. I've already primed these filters so they're ready to use. You need to remember to clean the filters and prime them at least every 12 months. These filters are amazing. If cared for correctly, they can last up to 23,000 litres or 11 years, whichever comes first. For this to happen and to get the best from them, we need to remember to clean and prime them regularly. As I mentioned earlier, priming the filters when they are new is really important. This opens them up, giving you the maximum performance and lifespan. I've shown you how to prime the filters in another video, so please be sure to have a look at that. As these filters are already primed, the system is now ready to use. All that's left to do is to top it up with water. The water will then filter down, filling the lower chamber in approximately 60 to 90 minutes. And you're ready to enjoy your Berkey 